Nearly 90,000 Hong Kongers apply for new British resettlement visa. Here's a summary of the article. Nearly 90,000 Hong Kongers have applied for resettlement in Britain under a new visa scheme offering a pathway to citizenship, London said Tuesday as it issued a report condemning China's crackdown on dissent in the former colony. Britain rolled out the visa scheme in January for more than 5 million Hong Kongers in response to Beijing's imposition of a sweeping national security law last year. Britain previously predicted about 154,000 Hong Kongers would arrive in the first year, and as many as 322,000 over five years. Applicants must hold a British national passport, which are available to Hong Kongers born before the city's return to Chinese rule in 1997, along with their dependents. British Prime Minister Boris Johnson has faced pressure to extend the visa scheme to cover younger Hong Kongers who do not qualify for a BNO passport. UK PM Johnson welcomes families who immigrated from Hong Kong under new visa scheme. UK opens special visa route for Hong Kong residents to become British citizens. This post received a score of 7,400, with an upvote ratio of 96%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. The Hong Kong residency visa is the subject of much scrutiny. As this article has shown, it has become increasingly difficult to obtain. The UK's new resettlement visa is an answer to these problems. The UK's new resettlement visa will grant you indefinite leave to remain in the United Kingdom, and also provides you with full access to public funds. What if you have kids? Below 18 yo you probably qualify for dependent visa and can go with your parents and stay until you're 18, at which point hopefully you're enrolled in school and can stay on a student visa. It builds from there. If you're on your parents' PR application, you also get PR. Students' visas aren't necessary. Even the current government aren't big on separating kids from their parents. Wow. That's a lot of people. I'm not sure what the process is like, but I'm sure it's a lot of work to go through all those applications. Good luck to everyone who applies. Just as well Britain doesn't have a housing shortage. Blame parasite landlords and the government for that. It's actually why Thadarite generation are marginally richer than the current one. And hash X to OOB. Maggie Thadar thought it would be a good idea to take one third road of public housing and flog it all. The rich got extremely wealthy and the working middle class found themselves able to buy a house in London for peanuts and are now sitting on millions. Boris Johnson praying they all drive trucks. We need to build more housing desperately. I'm not against this at all but house prices are already insane and an extra 90,000 people is going to be a good whack in the gonads. Housing princes are going to explode. I've only heard of Nigerian princes, but sure. Oh god the real estate prices are going to go even higher. Yup just look at what happened Vancouver, Honkouver, and Toronto. As a Brit, I'm very happy to welcome any Hong Kongers with open arms who come to live here. I hope they find happiness here. What about Afghans? The sweaters, hounds, blankets and people are all chill with me. The rugs really tie a room together too. I hope Britain accepts Hong Kongers. We do. We've already got a large population of Hong Kongers and there are a shitload of Chinese students over here. I'm speaking from a Newcastle perspective. Personally I love what the Chinese community adds to the region. This could lead to a massive culture shift in Europe decades from now. That sounds like a dream. Gemma Chan is a prime minister. Too bad the British didn't offer these visas prior to the handover like the Portuguese did with Macau. Instead, they tried to shoehorn democracy at the 11th hour and left the people to rot. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.